our species has gazed upon the night sky for millennia. We've wondered about those points of light, their distance, and whether we are alone in the vastness of space. Among these celestial wonders, Mars, the red planet, has captivated us like no other. Is there life out there? Was there ever? Mars, our celestial neighbor, holds a unique allure. Its reddish hue, visible even to the naked eye, hints at a world both alien and familiar. It's a planet of stark beauty, with towering volcanoes, vast canyons, and polar ice caps that shimmer in the sunlight. For centuries, we've dreamed of reaching Mars, of unlocking its secrets. Through the lens of telescopes, we observed its changing seasons, its polar ice caps expanding and contracting with the Martian year. These observations fueled our imagination, leading us to speculate about the possibility of life on this distant world. Could there be Martians, perhaps not the little green men of science fiction, but microbial life hidden beneath the surface? The allure of Mars is more than just scientific curiosity. It represents a challenge, a frontier to be explored. It's a testament to our innate desire to push the boundaries of knowledge, to venture beyond the familiar, and to seek answers to some of humanity's oldest questions. Our quest to understand Mars began in earnest in the 20th century. Early missions like NASA's Mariner and Viking programs provided our first glimpses of the Martian surface. These robotic pioneers beamed back images of a desolate yet strangely beautiful world, a world shaped by ancient volcanoes, massive dust storms and the faint whisper of a long-lost atmosphere. Historian the Viking landers in the 1970s marked a pivotal moment. They were our first successful attempts to land spacecraft on another planet. While they found no definitive evidence of life, they did reveal a planet surprisingly rich in geological diversity. Images from Viking revealed vast plains, towering volcanoes like Olympus Mons, the largest volcano in our solar system, and a system of canyons, Valles Marineris, so grand it dwarfs our own Grand Canyon. These early missions whetted our appetite for exploration but they also revealed the challenges of reaching Mars. The thin Martian atmosphere makes landing difficult, and the vast distances involved pose significant engineering hurdles. Yet these challenges only strengthened our resolve. We developed new technologies, refined our spacecraft designs, and prepared for a new era of Martian exploration, an era that would see us rove across the surface, drill beneath its crust, and search for signs of ancient life with unprecedented precision, an era that would bring us closer than ever before to understanding the mysteries of the Red Planet. In 2012, a new explorer touched down on the Martian surface, Curiosity a car-sized rover equipped with a suite of scientific instruments. Curiosity's mission was ambitious, to explore Gale Crater, a massive impact basin thought to have once held a lake billions of years ago. Scientist media, Curiosity exploring Gale Crater on Mars, scientist analyzing data from Curiosity rover on Mars. Curiosity didn't disappoint. Its instruments detected the presence of clay minerals, which form in the presence of water. This discovery provided further evidence that Mars was once a much warmer and wetter planet than it is today. Imagine rivers flowing, lakes shimmering under a Martian sun, a stark contrast to the dry, dusty landscape we see today. But Curiosity's discoveries weren't confined to the past. It also found evidence of organic molecules, the building blocks of life as we know it. This finding, while not proof of life itself, was a tantalizing hint that Mars might have once possessed the conditions necessary for life to arise. As Curiosity continues its journey, it sends back a wealth of data, enriching our understanding of Mars and its potential for life. Each image, each data point, brings us closer to answering the question, was there ever life on Mars? While Curiosity roamed the surface, another mission was listening to the Red Planet's heartbeat. In 2018, NASA's InSight lander touched down on Mars, its mission to study the planet's interior. Unlike the rovers, InSight would remain stationary, its instruments probing deep beneath the surface. Engineer InSight carried a seismometer, a device designed to detect Mars quakes, the Martian equivalent of earthquakes. By studying these seismic waves, scientists hope to learn more about the planet's internal structure, its core, mantle, and crust. InSight has detected hundreds of Mars quakes, providing valuable data about the planet's internal structure. 
It's revealed that Mars is seismically active, its interior still cooling and contracting billions of years after its formation. This data helps us understand how rocky planets like Earth and Mars formed and evolved over time. InSight's mission may be over, but its legacy continues. The data it collected will be studied for years to come, providing invaluable insights into the heart of the Red Planet.